Hey, uh, this is Dennis. I got me a sun oven. Let's see if we uh, we can't cook us something with a sun oven today. Let's get it out of the back of the Jeep here. Sun oven. We're going to go ahead and get it out of the Jeep and uh, unbox it and get it cleaned up and uh, start cooking. All right, here's the sun oven. Let's see how much of this I can show you and unpack. I'm trying to video and with one hand. All right. With a thermometer, bread trays, cooking rack. Cooking utensils. We'll go ahead and get all this out of the box and uh, we'll see what we got then. Alright, well, I got it opened up and uh, in the package it's got. Two of these real nice granite ware rotis, rotisserie, three pound poultry, nine and three quarters by five and three quarters deep um, hands. This is a leveling tray, so when your food's in there, it'll stay level. That's two bread pans, two nine stick brownie pans. Um, here it is open with the thermometer. It's got a CD and a before you start cooking. These are our, our um, solar pieces. Let me get this all opened up. Um, we'll take the blue reflective or protective film off of them. And uh, I decided we're going to go ahead and try cooking a South Louisiana style beans and rice. So uh, let me get a little bit further here, get some things started and going, and uh, check back in with you in a little bit. Thanks. All right, I got this um, set up and I got all the protective film off of the, the lenses. So you can see it's open. We're going to start with uh, the sausage part of this, and I got some. Uh, Real nice chili verde and a Basque sausage from uh, Wooddale Market, my favorite butcher shop. They uh, helped me dress my game. And a little bit of uh, light olive oil. We're going to be putting it in the, the container here with the lid so I can see what's going on. Now, the, the idea behind this is when you, you're looking at your shadow, um, you want this facing the sun from what I understand and angled so that you're you're following the same path now um, we're gonna give this a shot I'm gonna go ahead and add the sausages into the pot and the oil and uh, we'll see what's next all right the the sausagers are in our sun oven the temperature looks like it's about a hundred and thirty five right now maybe a hundred and forty let's uh, go ahead and give this some time and see what happens I'll check back in a little while uh, next my recipe called for onions garlic stalk of celery and the bell pepper cut up and sauteed with the sausage until they're translucent so I'm going to go ahead and get these cut up and then we'll uh, put them in just as soon as that uh, sausage reaches its uh, sizzle, sizzle spot. Alright, it's been a little bit more than an hour. I've got the, the bell pepper is cut up and the celery stock is cut up. I've already had the onions and garlic ready. It looks like the temperature right now is about 280 degrees not quite 300 
So I'm going to go ahead and uh, take it out, stir it up a little bit, and add those vegetables to it. Alright, so far everything's looking real good. I'm going to go ahead and uh, add this. A little bit more there. Yeah, I left that one whole sausage in there for uh, lunch. I'm going to get this mixed up and put it back in my sun oven and check on it here in a little while. Alright, let's check how everything's going. We're at about 320 degrees. I'm going to get this out. And, uh, the beans, uh, water, and cayenne, and uh, woo -wee. smells good and it's hot. I will we'll go ahead and get this out and bring it around the back and uh, uh, show you some more. Oh my goodness, this is looking so good and it smells great. Here's my beans that were soaked yesterday. And down there, you got the cayenne and a bay leaf. We're gonna go ahead and put in there. Uh, bottles of water. Go ahead and get everything added in. Uh, take a look at it and get her back in. All right, I've got it back in the sun oven. Opening it up made the temperature drop quite a bit. We're down to about 240. I'm gonna go ahead and get the black lid on it. Black lid helps uh, helps the heat go up a little bit. Get the door closed. Get the latches to steal the lid. And uh, we'll check her out again here in a while. Hey, a little bit of an update on our cooking. Um, it's been about an hour and 20 minutes. Uh, the cooker, the sun, sun oven, is maintaining 300 to 310 degrees. There's a lot of condensation built up on the glass right now, as you can see right here behind me. Um, we're going to give it about another 20 minutes, open it up, give it a stir, add the Creole seasoning, and uh, give another update then. All right, um, back, back to it, to the sun oven. You can see all the condensation on the on the glass right now but uh if we look real close it's uh it's kicking up there right at, at 310 to 320. now around the back side here uh, is, uh getting my my rice ready the rice is going to go in the, the lower container and um i didn't have any measuring cups so i went ahead and, and figured this is about a cup of rice and twice the volume of water should uh should get the get the the rice cooking uh, this right here is actually bacon grease I'm gonna put a teaspoon of bacon grease in with my rice to add a little bit of flavor to it and as soon as I get the rice ready I'm gonna get that in and pull out the other pot and get it nice and stirred up and check to see how the beans are cooking and and add the the Creole seasoning and salt and pepper to taste and as soon as I get that done, we'll go ahead and um, I'll, I'll let you know how things are coming along. All right, so here's what's going on. Man, it's, it smells great. It tastes great. The, um, the beans aren't quite all the way cooked yet, but that's perfect because uh, now we've got the rice in. The rice is in, and we're going to put this pot right back over the other one again uh, cover them all up and keep on cooking and we'll uh, check them again here in a little while and uh, getting ready for supper time uh, take a quick look and see what's going on here let's see a lot of condensation on the glass 
there, right at about 300 degrees. If you look close in the center of the glass, you can actually see the, the water is boiling on the top of the pot. Uh, we've got little wisps of steam escaping out from the seal here and there. Um, we're going to give this about another 15 minutes and we're going to pull the rice out. Hopefully it's cooked and our beans have softened up and uh, we can head home and have a great supper. Alright, I'm about to open this up and I'm, uh, I'm going to see um, if I can't get it to, to um, show you how much steam and heat is actually coming out of this last few times that I've opened it it's it's uh it's been quite impressive with the, the heat so let's see if I can open this with one hand and show you the steam that comes out I don't know if uh, that's going to show up on the video we'll try it wow this smells great um, uh, I'll get back to you here in a bit. I'm excited to get this thing opened up and see how everything turned out. Alright, I'm excited. The rice looks great. It's, uh, actually, I don't think I've ever cooked rice this perfect before. Let's go ahead and, uh, get the lid off here. Oh, man. Wow. Now, uh, this looks great. I uh, had the test is in the beans. Wow. Beans are perfect. I think uh, I can't wait to get this home. and uh, make some cornbread at home. I didn't have time to make it in the sun oven and uh, <laughs> get my southern Louisiana style beans and rice for my dinner. Done today with the sun oven. <laughs> right before I left at work. This is awesome. Uh, thanks for watching. Maybe I'll uh, update on everybody liked about it. Have a great day. Be blessed.